so far? Uh, the season's been really good. Uh, it's better than any other season since I got here. It's fourth year here. Got here when Coach did, so uh, it's definitely the best team we've had, best results we've had, and uh, I'm really proud of the number two spot. We worked really hard against Shriner to get that and, and the rest of the year. And going into the tournament, what does the team uh, have as its goals for this tournament? Goals for the tournament is, uh, I mean, first round, take it a step at a time. We're going to, you know, do, do the work we got to do in the first round and see where that takes us. The goal would be, obviously, to win, but, uh, I mean, take it a match at a time. We're playing Centenary in the first round, and uh, we beat them 8-1 last time we played them. And uh, we're pretty confident about going into our match with them and, uh, and uh, maybe hoping to get it in 9-0. <laughs> Right. And what's your role? Uh, what, do you, uh, when do they decide where you'll be playing doubles, singles? Uh, or what's your role come come the tournament? Um, I'll be playing line three doubles with uh, Kyle Thompson. Okay. And uh, usually the lineups come out day before or day of. Yeah. Uh, kind of, you know, gauging where we're at when we get there. Um, but yeah, I should be playing line three doubles with Kyle Thompson. And what's the key for you and Kyle to be successful in doubles? Just communication. Uh, we just started playing halfway through the semester together, so uh, you know the first match was pretty rough. But uh, as far as uh, we lost that one, but uh, since that we've we've communicated really well and uh, known whose ball is which, and you know moved with each other. Right. So I think it's just staying positive and keeping with it. All right. Well, thanks, Henry. Thank you. Okay, we're here with Caitlin Czar. Caitlin, you're a captain. Just give me an overview of what the year's been like for you guys. Um, we've had a pretty good year so far. Um, we've been through a few matches where some girls haven't been able to play and we've you know, had to work around that and everything. But so far, I think overall we've done really well with making adjustments and adjusting to all the changes. Um, but we're ready for the conference tournament. And what's it been like for you as a captain? What are the big things for you as a captain that you have to think about going into a match? Um, my biggest thing is preparing the girls. And um, I kind of get nervous easily before matches, so I try to you know, keep myself from expressing that to them and um, basically just getting them pumped up and prepared for whoever we're playing that day and kind of give them an insight to the team that we're playing since I do have more experience being a junior. I kind of let them know, you know, what to expect and how the team is going into it. And what's your excitement level going into this new tournament, this conference tournament setting with the SCAC? Um, I'm actually really excited. It's a whole new format um, from what we're used to at the ASC, so I'm actually really excited to see how it goes. And um, I mean, we've played a lot of the teams before throughout the um, preseason, but um, I'm really excited to go into the conference tournament with high expectations for the team. And you and Sophia have been doubles partners throughout this year, and what's it been like playing with Sophia? You guys um, have had a good year at number one doubles. I love playing with Sophia. I mean, we both have the same high-intensity level, and um, that's really crucial at number one because we're playing a lot of the top competitors in the conference, and um, our high intensity level that we have with one another and we're really compatible that that's really key and that's what i think helps us be most successful all right well thanks caitlin thanks Thank for you. your time thank you okay here with sophia vega and sophia you go into the seac tournament this weekend and just tell me about your general uh knowledge of what's going to happen this weekend and new to me as well uh, and your general expectations about this tournament um i'm really excited about this tournament um it's definitely going to be different from the conference tournament in the ASC because it's no longer single elimination. I think it's nice that um, if we lose, we get to play an extra match and just play all the places out and, and see uh, how far we've come throughout the semester. Um, I think first round being against Colorado College, we haven't played them since last year and we lost to them really close, 5-4, so I think our chances against them are good this year. Um, I haven't seen their team, but we definitely have a better team this year than we did last year, so um, I'm, I'm pretty confident about, about the match, but I know it's definitely going to be a tough one. We'll see how it goes. Going in that match with Caitlin at number one doubles, what do you guys focus on? Um, Caitlin and I always tell it tell each other, you know, do the right things. At the beginning of the match, we practice very, very fundamental things, and we do it over and over and over again in practice, coming into the net, uh, serving and volleying, and um, putting our volleys where they need to go cross court. So that's what we focus on during doubles. We always tell each other, do the right things, do, do the right things. Don't try to overdo anything or uh, hit anything fantastic. Just be good on the fundamentals. So. And then how about the key for you when you get to singles? When I get to singles, I think the key for me is um, 
just to kind of have a set uh, game plan, you know, whether it is to uh, keep the ball to the backhand and, and hit with a lot of depth or um, stuff like that. But uh, definitely not get, um, not try to take off some of the pressure that's that's been on my shoulders lately and kind of just play like I have nothing to lose. Um, and that's what I what I try to focus on the most. Just kind of what I practice a lot here, being aggressive and stuff like that. Does it help to hit with these guys here? It definitely helps to hit with the guys. Um, Talk about what it's been like having that target on your back all year and being the number one ranked player. Well, uh, I do feel more pressure this year than I did last year as a freshman because I I had no expectations. I had nothing to lose last year. And uh, this year I definitely have, you know, came in wanting to to do to do even better here with Kyle Thompson and Kyle first year as a team captain what's that been like being with these guys this year uh, it's been a great experience uh, these guys are a lot of fun to work with and play with and especially out on the court so it's been a great experience so far as a team and bonding and what's been uh, the year like for you guys uh, you guys got the number two seed um, a, a good regular season and just give me your opinion on how the regular season has gone for you. Uh, so far we've had a really good season. We've um, beat the teams that we should beat and uh, lost some tough matches but um, overall we've gained some great pointers out of everything, out of every match and to kind of prepare us for this conference tournament and earn the number two seed. And what are the expectations for you guys in this upcoming SCAC tournament? Uh, well, we set a goal at the beginning of the year to get to the conference tournament final, so that's definitely still our goal, and um, to just continue playing our tennis and how we know how to play as a team and work towards the goal. And with you at, at in doubles, what, we talked to Henry, your doubles partner. You guys are going to be playing number three doubles. What's going to be uh, the focus for you and Henry in, that, uh, in that, those matches? Definitely just working towards um, getting a point for our team and do the best we can to get that point. And then what about you You in singles particularly? Uh, same thing, just kind of get my point for my team, do my part, and trust in the other guys. I know they can do it too. Right. Anything you have to focus on in particular with your game, what's key for you in your game? Um, just kind of staying consistent and making the other players work and make them earn their points and me earn my points. All right. Well, Kyle, good luck this weekend. Thank you. Thank you.